A new club at South Dakota State University is bringing cattle enthusiasts together. The goal is to help them learn more about the beef industry. When senior animal science student Isaac Berg attended the National Cattlemen's Beef Association's Cattle Con, he noticed that several universities had collegiate cattlemen's clubs on their campuses. That inspired him to bring the organization to SDSU. And I kind of sat on it for a year and then um, the, this past spring rolled around and I decided why don't we have one again and then I really started kicking in, into gear. Having this organization on campus gives students a place to come together and learn about beef cattle no matter their background in the industry. I just wanted a place for other like-minded individuals uh, in the cattle uh, industry to get together and kind of just be together, learn, uh, and increase everyone's network. The club was developed last spring, but has seen significant growth this fall, averaging around 100 students per meeting. I think it's really exciting uh, to see how many students that we can bring forth. My biggest takeaway would probably be there are kids out there that want to learn more. They want to be further engaged. They want to do more on part of their, not only the industry that they love, but on the university they love. That was really hitting home to me, seeing how many kids want to take part in that. Collegiate Cattlemen's Club brings in industry professionals to discuss issues and hot topics within beef cattle production. I think it really opens up uh, people's eyes to uh, what else is out there than uh, possibly their own uh, ranches to go back to or if they don't have a ranch to go back to. It gives um, others more insight in what is out there. As the club continues to grow, they hope to plan off-campus experiences for their members. This spring, they would like to make a ranch visit trip around South Dakota to learn more from cattle producers in the state. They also hope to be able to travel to CattleCon as a club in the future. Thanks for watching AgWeek TV on YouTube. Make sure to like and subscribe. We put out new videos every Saturday.